Hey and welcome to your first Minecraft modding tutorial. I'm going to be showing you guys how to mod in Minecraft 1.7.10 because that's the latest stable release out right now. They have 1.8 and they're coming out with 1.8.1 releases but uh, those are pretty buggy so I'm just going to do 1.7.10 and you'll only need to download three things and that is the source for 1.7.10 which you can find at files.minecraftforge.net you just go over here download source and then you'll need Eclipse which is a development IDE for Java so you could just go to this link I'll put it in the description and then download for your system and then the last thing you'll need is the Java JDK which you can download from Oracle so once you have downloaded everything you'll want to set up Eclipse which I have already done and basically you just run the installer and that's it you could drag it to your applications and then open it but we don't need to open it yet because first we need to create a workspace so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our file that we downloaded from Forge which I've already put mine on my desktop and unzipped it we're gonna take this and we're gonna copy everything Once we've copied that, we'll create a new folder. We'll say mod tutorial and then open that up and paste everything in there. Next, in order to set up our workspace, because uh, Forge works with Eclipse, that's why it already has this Eclipse file in it, we just need to set it up. So we'll go over to our desktop, or sorry, we'll go over to our terminal and we'll type cd desktop slash whatever our folder is. Ours is mod tutorial. Let's just make sure it's everything. Yep, that's what we need. So we'll say dot slash gradle setup decomp workspace. And this will take a few minutes, so I will skip to when it finishes. Uh, some uh, Last time I did it took about a minute 20 seconds. Sometimes it takes five minutes. I guess it just depends, but I'll come back when it's done. Okay, so mine finished in, wow, only 44 seconds this time. So now that we've done the setup decomp workspace, you can see that added a few things. We'll do dot slash grade loo eclipse. And then this will take a little bit longer. Or actually, I think it's a little bit shorter than the other one. And once this is done, we can actually open up eclipse and start modding. Alright, so mine finished. Now I could close this and we have everything set up. So I'm going to go and open Eclipse. And the first thing Eclipse is going to ask me to do is choose where I want to mod or where my workspace is going to be. So I'm going to go to Desktop, Mod Tutorial, which is the file we just created, head over to Eclipse, and then press Open and then we'll say OK and next it will open our Eclipse IDE in our mod tutorial workspace let's move this in the center okay so this is our Eclipse IDE if you've never used Eclipse before uh, it's pretty useful for Java development um, you might want to take some time look through the documentation or tutorials on how to actually use this um, if you don't already know, but for what I'm going to do, it's pretty simple, and if you just follow along, uh, you shouldn't have much trouble. First, I'm going to close that, and you can see this is our source right here. This is all the files we have, and in source.main.java, well, source slash main slash java, we have this example mod. right now it doesn't really do much but as you can see this is like the start of a mod and we even have this example mod right here so let's just first we could just change this to let's say tutorial mod and then we'll save that and run it and we'll see what happens alright so if we click here mods we could see we have this tutorial mod uh, version 1.0 uh, right now it's not really going to do anything so we can close this 
but as you can see we've basically set up how we're gonna start modding and I'll leave it at that for now this will just be the setup video and in the next one we'll add some ores and maybe after that some blocks and items thanks for watching